Here's three business why markets care about Putin's aggression. In 2021, investors might have averted their eyes from a military conflict in Ukraine. But as concerns about inflation and reduced support from central banks loom, geopolitical tensions that could hurt the global economy are taking center stage. What's happening? Global stocks swung after Russian President Vladimir Putin ordered Russian troops into two separatist pro-Moscow regions in eastern Ukraine. Countries, including the United States, are preparing to impose sanctions. Oil prices shot up, with Brent crude futures, the global benchmark, at one point topping 99% per barrel. The unfolding crisis could set up another volatile trading day in the United States. The S&P 500 finished Friday down more than 9% from its January peak, if it reaches the 10% threshold when trading closes on Tuesday. Russia is a major exporter of oil and gas. If the flow of energy is disrupted because of the conflict in Ukraine, that could weigh on the global recovery. Sentiment has turned the mood among investors, turned door over the past month as soaring inflammation boosted expectations on Wall Street that the Federal Reserve and other central banks would need to intervene more aggressively if they sharply hike interest rates and start to reduce the number of bonds on their balance sheets that would take away the main source of market euphoria since the pandemic hit. But that is why there is really a difficulty if there is a conflict for Russia.